Hey guys, it's me, the Bearded Gamer, and I just recently saw something about, you know, the new season premiere of The Walking Dead, and the Parent Association, thank you phone, the Parent Association, or something like that, it's called whatever, I call them the Nazis, or the Fem Nazis, or just the ones that really want to control what you watch, what you hear, what you see. They're upset. Even though AMC put, you know, parental advisory, hey, this is some violent shit you're about to see. Well, I didn't say it like that, but you get the drift. They're still pissed off. Yes, now I know The Walking Dead it was pretty brutal. It actually got this beard a little titillated, if you will. But that's our freedom. That's our choice. This is what we should be able to have. We should be able to have the choice in this country. Now, why would I bring up The Walking Dead? Because I'm tired with the same thing with, you know, comic books or anime or mainly for me, video games. Look, I'm a grown ass adult. Yes, and I know there are adults or I'm sorry, there are teens out there that get their hands on that stuff. Well, whatever happened to parenting? Good parenting will advise what you can and cannot watch. Now, if I see something extremely brutal or i know it'd be kind of fragile for my son's mind and i'm talking oh, probably 10 years ago when he was six years old yeah i probably wouldn't let him watch it however i didn't shield him away from it completely in other words i let him watch it in small dose so he could understand the difference between reality and tv or video games you gotta understand the difference. I mean, just because I love playing, you know, sometimes violent video games doesn't mean that my fat ass gets up and I'm thinking about, oh my God, I'm gonna butcher that guy with a chainsaw. No, that takes too much goddamn work and I'm a lazy fuck. I mean, just because somebody likes watching anime, you know, and they always got the, you know, the, the cute little girls or whatever with the big boobs and everything like that, especially the Japanese anime. Just because somebody likes watching it doesn't give anybody the right saying, that's too sexually graphic. You're not allowed to watch it. No. No. Bullshit. And I'm tired. And it's more and more. And I'm tired and tired of more and more of censorship. It's getting ridiculous. It's like, sorry. The SJWs, they come out there, sorry. You're not allowed to watch it. We don't like it. So you're not allowed to watch it. Why can't anybody make their own choice? That's how business is supposed to be. Make a choice. You like the product or not. If you like the anime, you like seeing that stuff, that's good for you. But that doesn't mean the person that's watching it is a sexual perverted person that's going to go out and look for girls that are, happen to be dressed like that and take advantage of them. That's not what it means. And usually, that isn't what happened. Now, I know there are some sicko and fuckos out there. Hey, that's life. There is a lot of them out there. That happens. That's why we got to be on guard to watch them or keep an eye on them. But does it mean don't take away anybody's freedom because you don't because you don't agree that they should be watching this? I mean, especially with video games. Oh my god, you know, got the rated M for mature and the rated teen for teen and stuff like that. And oh god, we we just we got to shelter that away. We got to keep that away. We got to keep that away. We got to push that away. We got to modify it. We got to monitor it all the time. God damn it. We have enough in this country that's monitoring us. Somebody's monitoring right now, probably through my camera. Hi, NSA. How you doing? You like looking at my beard? Fucking could trim it too. But anyway, back to what was my point? Oh, I know what my point is. I'm tired of these so-called groups that think they're going to make things better by shunning them. Let's, let's take a little history trip, shall we? How about Prohibition? Did that work? Let's take away alcohol because there was a few, the Tempest movement, a few women that felt, well, this isn't right. Our men shouldn't be drinking beer and they shouldn't be going out and getting drunk and stuff like that. Now, granted, a lot of people did, including you two women, but shunning it and making it illegal was stupid. It was so stupid. All you did is make gangsters rich like Al Capone and the New York Mafia. They made money. Why? Because it was the taboo of the day. Some anime is the same way like that. Look at those magma books, you know. People like that. And if you're going to make it a taboo or illegal to purchase, I don't know, it's a taboo. People are interested. They're going to want to see it. They're going to want to, maybe they're going to want to buy it. They're going to want to look at it. 
So I don't understand this push that we gotta censor everything. We gotta censor it. We gotta remove it. We gotta remove it from the existence of your minds. Stop. Just, maybe not stop, but just slow down a little bit. All you gotta do, I mean, just think about it. Yes, I know there are some grotesque stuff out there. Yes, I know there are extremely violent video games out there, like Hatred, for example. I know they're out there. I understand. But let the parents start doing their job. Let the parents, quote-unquote, censor it, or limit exposure, as I call it. But completely keeping it out of a you know child's mind or people's mind completely makes it a taboo. And then, then you got people really, really wanting it. That's my opinion. I mean, I really, really wish we would just kind of slow down on this censorship, censorship in these groups and these people that want to shut down everything and take away people's right for watching what they want to watch. I don't know. What do you guys think? I'm the Bearded Gamer. You guys stay sexy as hell, YouTube pop filter. And let me guys know what you think in your comments. Leave a comment below. Hey, tell me whatever you want. I'm the Bearded Gamer, which I already said like two seconds ago, but I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.